again, Martin is Kevin with the shot clock at five. Fluger sidesteps for the three and nails it. Fluger feeding it inside. Kevin off the block, makes his move into the post. And a sweet baby hook opens the scoring. Now BC, Robinson feeding it inside. And a nice move by Popovich. Farrell over the top, skipping to Fluger in the corner. Now Gibbs for three. And that's good. Boy, that's something Boston College saw way too much of in the first game, particularly in the first half. They're high for T.J. Gibbs, 8-2 Irish. Good start for Notre Dame on the road. And from the corner, there's Jerome Robinson. These teams met 11 days ago. Notre Dame winning a high-scoring affair. Farrell for three. He was trying to get a little offensive rhythm here, but they turn it over. And leaking out as Matt Farrell takes it up and in. Well, that was some pass by Moody. Notre Dame bidding for its sixth ACC win. Farrell, top side three, and the Irish wow. rolling early. Wow. BC is going to take a timeout. Matt Farrell with eight. Many of the shots, Robinson, Chapman, and Bowman have not. Robinson trapped in the lane. Chapman now going up and good. And this crowd. It's filled uh, the county court to the Raptors. Not much to cheer about as the Irish go to Burns for a slam. Bearing rebound for Torres. The Irish Bob doing a great job contesting shots. And it's been basically one and done for BC as Farrell continues his lights out shooting. That's his third three. BC settling for some tough shots here. Uh, Bowman is the guy, Bob, I think he's got to try to get to the basket. Farrell. Oh, my! Matt Farrell with another three, and Boston College has to take another timeout. So he's their leader. They look to him to score, and times are tough right now for the Eagles. Bowman takes it up and in. This is a guy that can help as well with drives like that. Farrell. And a nice pass inside sets up Torres for the lay-in. Ask it from Burns. They're getting contributions from guys off their bench. Popovich will drive it and slam it. And Joe go to the wing and Gibbs. Another. Our ACC network of stations. Robinson. That's a two. Jerome Robinson now with five points. Bowman starts the break here for BC. Chapman to the trailing Robinson. Airspace from three and nails it. Timeout in Boston. The Irish in command. Don't think they can fall in love with that shot. If they're going to produce today, I think they've got to get the ball inside. Wow, from Natick. Okay, maybe not. On the defensive end, he gets some easy shots down on the other end. Luger scoots out of the double on the baseline. Moody's going to drive it and lay it in. John Moody's first two. Gibbs comes around on the handoff. Kevin. Really well. He's very mobile. Can shoot the little jump shot. Now Notre Dame goes to the 2-3 zone. And Robinson gives right in the middle of it to score. Kevin goes cross court. Fluger drives. Finds Farrell another. Yes! Around the rim and in. 23 for Matt Farrell. He steps in to a wide open area. Excellent job by the Irish, Dan. Moving the ball from side to side. Robinson gets the friendly roll. To the corner, Chapman, a three. Popovich gives Robinson from the wing. And that bucket must look like an ocean. What happened that time, Bob? They didn't move the ball at all. Fluger kept in his hands the whole time. They got a tough shot. Three for Bowman in the corner. And the Duke Clemson game at Little John for second place in the conference. Please raise your <laughs> hand. Turnaround by Gibbon. Matt Farrell. Launching. No. Oh, oh, wow. Matt Farrell. Well, within Farrell, reach. Farrell has some time there. Like maybe now. Drives this one. And it's rejected. Then there's a bench going to cool off, and so if you're Boston College, you just keep playing. 
you've got the firepower. Robinson off the dribble for three. That's a perfect example. Seven seconds. Gibbs leans in and scores. Matt Farrell on the wing. Nice pass. And right down the middle to Gibbon. Trapped under the basket. And Notre Dame takes the pass away. Farrell goes cross court. Gibbs lets it fly, and that's a three. T.J. Gibbs with his second. Have to start on that journey pretty quickly. 21-point spread, the biggest lead for the Irish. Backdoor cutting, Gibbs lays it in. <laughs> the way this one's going forward. That is the eighth Boston College turnover. Oh, my. Here we go again. Nine for nine. Yes, it is. Good strip by Pfluger. As Robinson was rising up, and then Bowman slaps it down. And the Fluger needs a moment. Boston College hasn't been able to do that today in Notre Dame. That ball has been moving. Not a lot of dribbling by the Irish. Robinson feeding it inside. And one for Stephon Mitchell. Today blocking shots and rebounding, but here he just gets great position inside. That's good patience. And a poke away, and Mooney controls the dribble, takes it up rather Gibbon, and he slams it. 13.50 to play. Bob, and the reason that Mooney shot that free throw is... And the three. Two. Two. They're going to check it. All right. That's a long road back, but you got to start somewhere. Popovich hits a three. It's a three. And maybe that is going to signal a change in this game. Bowman, yes! And this is Bowman, what he can do if he gets in transition, he is hard to stop. Good defense. Rebound. Good defense that time. You don't have to steal the ball from him, you just have to make him shoot it over top and Mitchell gets it. Robinson puts it down. Way to the basket goes Jogo for a jam. College is in danger of giving up easy baskets. Jogo made him pay that time. The turn and the hook goes by Reyes. Gibbs. On the reverse, drew three defenders and slithered through to the other side. But he really had a position to block the shot. Robinson's bounce to Popovich. Outstanding defense by Mitchell. Chapman with the left hand. See, hasn't been this close since the first five minutes of the game. The lay in rolls in. That's twice now that Jogo has taken advantage of a lane to the basket. Misses the three. Bowman leads a three on three to the rack. BC. And I think the first thing, if it goes down, will be an eruption from the crowd. Robinson off the window. They've cut it to nine. 15 on the shot clock, 5.35 to go. Jogo corner three is good. Boy, what a big shot that is. Robin, I would point out that Fluger stays over on the bench for Notre Dame after falling and injuring his back. Jogo has provided a very adequate replacement. Gibbs oh my. puts it down. T.J. Gibbs. Robinson over Gibbs. Oh. A three. A stop and a hoop, and it's going to be game on the last four minutes. Farrell driving off the high glass for two. Nine three-pointers, eight in the first half. 29 for Jerome Robinson. Farrell. Got it! And that ties the Notre Dame record, 10 in a game. So you lose at home to NC State, then you go on and beat Miami. A league where you can take nothing for granted. Kevin. That's right, nice Under control catch. move. Irish putting together a finishing kick of 16 to 6. Bowman floats it home. He's got 13 of 1.3, so they'll put it in and Take the final second off the clock, and that will do it. The final horn sounds, and Notre Dame with a huge win on the road and a huge day from Matt Farrell.